Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Bite. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is a hospital held hostage by ransomware. Over the past few weeks, an LA-based hospital called the Hollywood Presbyterian Medical Center has been battling a ransomware on many of its systems. According to various reports, this ransomware has really affected the hospital, forcing them to disable their network at certain times and also fall back on paper registrations for patients. On top of that, some of the reports even said that the hospital had to turn away patients and direct them to other medical centers. Now the latest news is the hospital has finally succumbed to this actual ransomware and they've paid the extortion of 17,000 US dollars to get this ransomware off the system. Now if you've watched my videos you probably know my beliefs on whether or not you should pay ransomware. I'm against it but I'm not here to judge. A hospital is a pretty special situation where lives could be at risk. That said we need to remember that paying ransom actually encourages these criminals to continue their activities. But whether or not the hospital paid is really not the point of this video. It's what we should do to protect ourselves from ransomware. And by the way, if you check out my 2016 predictions, you'll know that ransomware will continue to evolve and get worse this year. So it's something you need to look out for. Now normally the tips I give you are to have layered security like what WatchGuard's UTM appliances provide and also have advanced threat protection like APT blocker. To change things up, I'm going to offer some e equally important advice, which is to also concentrate on disaster recovery and business continuity. Prevention is very important in security, but this is equally as important. First of all, backups. A lot of ransomware today is crypto ransomware, meaning it locks your files. If you have backups, you can quickly recover from this sort of ransomware. But on top of that, you need to have backup plans. There could be natural disasters like earthquakes that take out your energy or your computer systems. And of of course, digital disasters like this one that bring down your network as well. You need to plan for this and have some sort of backup systems ready so that you can recover your business, or in this case, your hospital, in case of these sorts of emergencies. So of course, continue to make sure to have the full kill chain defenses that UTM appliances provide, but also spend some time and effort considering your business continuity and disaster recovery plan. Anyways, that's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.